If you're an SMA owner, how are you gonna get more clients with cold email? I'm gonna go over the exact email strategy that I used when doing cold emailing when I first started, and how I got clients, and how I did the exact same sales process to get them in for a good offer and then upsell them on the ad services. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and let's get right into it. So first off, when you're doing cold email, you can get leads, like the actual email list, from D7 Lead Finder. It's a really cool site that allows you to basically scrape email lists from certain zip codes or business owners, whatever the case may be. Uh, it's really cheap, cost effective, and you can use that literally in the next couple of minutes. So if you wanna get the email list of the people that you're targeting, let's say you want gyms in this state, or you want local businesses in this zip code, right? You can get those email lists from D7 Lead Finder. So you're gonna then take that email list and you're gonna then throw it into Lemlist. L-E-M-L-I-S-T, this is a email cold software. So before you even get into cold email though, like yeah, you could take all those emails and go to Lemlist and start sending with a Gmail, but you wanna buy, I would say, 10 domains because you're gonna burn through domains when you're cold emailing. So I would recommend you get 10 domains from GoDaddy, like $11 each, so about 120 bucks for these 10 domains to send out 10 blasts, okay? So you're gonna get into Lemlist, like 20 bucks a month, and you're gonna send an email to these you know, people doing a free website. This is what I did in the beginning. Okay, the whole free website thing worked really well. Um, I sent out these blasts to local business owners in Orlando in the Oviedo area where I used to live, um, saying like, hey, I'm looking for six business owners who want a free website. I'm gonna build you a completely free website, done for you, like no fees, no upfront costs, completely free. I'm doing this to gain experience. Um, and I want you to be, you know, my next case study. Okay, reply and I'll send you the, the details on how we can meet this week. I live in blah, blah, blah area. So I made it seem like, well, it's not what I made it seem like. It was actually true. Like I literally lived in Oviedo and I was only DMing, you know, emailing these business owners in the area of a five to 10 mile radius. Then once we set the dates and I got like 10 replies and, you know, about five to six of them actually wind up wanting to have a meeting. Go to the meeting, get the free website. Hey, like I'll do the free website and then it's this amount per month after if you want to have me run traffic to it because we do X, Y, and Z. This website usually costs 4K, but I'll do it for free. You know, if you like it, then you tell me, hey, I really like this and I'll, you know, unlimited edits, etc. I'll do the website management, do the SEO, make it rank higher, give me your competitors, I'll outrank them. And then, you know, if you want to get ads, it's 500 bucks a month and that's what I did in the beginning. You know, just to get my feet wet. I was like, hey, I'll get a free website, I'll pay for it on Fiverr or I'll do it myself. Because you could pay someone on Fiverr 100 bucks for a website, they turn it around and then you can now get the $500 a month once the client's satisfied with the website. Or you could do it manually through Wix and that's how I did it. I just used, you know, Wix because they have so many templates and you can copy and paste them over as you do the free websites. So that's how I used cold email to then close local business clients just by using a good offer, which is the free website. It's not that you're misleading people, then upsell them. It's that like, hey, it's a shit ton of value in a free website, or I'll revamp your current website and I'll outrank your competitors. It's another thing that you can add to the value of it. Maybe add a couple of blog posts to it. Uh, you know, maybe get somebody on Fiverr to do some quick, you know, local SEO for you for 40, 50 bucks. You know, bring that value to the table to make that client excited. So every business that you start, by the way, like you always have to have an upfront capital. You gotta be able to put your money where your mouth is to get clients results and get them in your ecosystem, get people to trust you. So. If you're trying to get more clients and you wanna use cold email, use that exact same strategy that it gave you and it will work. I got about, out of the five people, three of them signed up for ad services and I'm actually still working with two of them right now to this day and we're four and a half years later. So make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe to this video. I appreciate you guys stopping by. It makes us more motivated to pump out more videos just like this. So like I said again, just like, comment, subscribe. That's all I ask, it's free. And I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Peace.